Okay, hello Capricorns. How are you doing? This is Heavenly Tarot. Okay, we're going to find out what September has for you guys. Okay, all right. Like my channel. Like my video. I don't know why I like to say channel, but like my video. Okay, subscribe to my channel, please. All right. And you may share the video. All right, you guys. I, got, I hope you guys had a great weekend. All right. Thank you to all my subscribers for subscribing, having my support. I thank you. I thank you very much. Okay. God bless you guys. For supporting me. That is. Okay. All right. So here we go. We're going to find out what September has for you guys. Holy Spirit, show us what September has for our Capricorns. Holy Spirit, show us what September has for our Capricorns, Holy Spirit. Okay, show us, Holy Spirit, what September has for Capricorns. Okay, show us what September has for Capricorns. Okay, Eight of Swords, some of you are feeling stuck, will be feeling stuck in the month of September. Holy Spirit, show us what September has for Capricorn. Okay, okay, the Three of Swords, some of you are going to feel heartbroken. Okay, or be involved in a third party situation. Three of Wands. Some of you are going to be choosing someone over someone else. Choosing to step off in a new beginning. Okay. Holy Spirit, show us what September has for Capricorns. Holy Spirit. Too many cards. Show us what September has for Capricorns. Show us. Show us what September. Okay, three card. I'm gonna take up. Okay, justice. Some of you guys gonna want a victory, justice in a situation. Um, to a pinnacle. Some of you guys gonna find out about a juggling situation, or you're gonna be involved in a juggling situation. It could be like money. Yeah, your finances or a person you could be juggling jobs you might have to juggle jobs to make ends meet okay the empress okay some of you guys are gonna um this about family okay you're gonna find that empress or a baby might be on the way you might find out somebody's pregnant in the month of September okay Okay, so here we go. Holy Spirit. Okay, we're going to start with the Eight of Swords. Holy Spirit, clarify this Eight of Swords. Clarify this Eight of Swords. Okay. So you're stuck in a situation. You want to um, move forward in um, the Four of Wands. Happiness and enjoying life. Okay. Holy Spirit, clarify this Four of Wands. Okay, yeah, you want a success in this moving forward in happiness and having fun, enjoying life, okay? Wheel of Fortune, okay? So, you want good luck in this moving forward, but you're stuck. Or, or it could be a karma situation. You're determined to get this happiness, this enjoyment of life moving forward. You're determined to move, be able to move forward in this, okay? But something has you stuck. You feeling trapped. Capricorn. Okay. Okay. It could be with a Gemini. Okay. This could mean a Gemini as well. So you want this good luck with the Gemini. Okay. You see this Gemini as your soulmate. The lover's card. Okay. 
So you want to move forward. You're determined to get this as well. The car means determination. Okay, so you're determined to get this with this Gemini. Okay, Capricorn? All right. All right, so now it's the Three of Swords. There was heartbreak in the situation. Holy Spirit, or it could have been a third party. Let's find out which way it goes. Holy Spirit, clarify. Wow, you said that popped up? Wow. Okay, yeah. There's heartbreak in a commitment you had with the um, Emperor Aries. Okay. Yeah. Due to a Queen of Swords. So it was, a, yeah. It was a third party situation. Holy Spirit with the Queen of Swords and Aquarius. Okay. Seven of Wands. Okay. You were fighting suitors off. Protecting yourself. Okay. So you were from a uh, um, water sign. Okay. Okay, so you wanted to take a leap of faith. Who you wanted to take a leap of faith with. So you was you was protecting yourself from other suitors. Okay. So you could be with the water sign who you were um who you're you're gonna be wanting to take a leap of faith with. So yeah. So there was a third party situation um with somebody you was committed to. Okay, this person was an emperor person, an Aries. You had them in the third part. Yeah. To do with the Queen of Swords. Who you're protecting yourself from. To be with the water sign. And have a leap of faith. Okay? So you were involved with the bossy controlling. Um. Aquarius, okay, whom you were protecting yourself from, or that person was, okay, and this person is a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio person, who you want to take a leap of faith with, but they're involved with an Aquarius, okay, all right, <clears throat> so that's what that goes, so that's September, that's what you're going to be trying to do, okay. So, okay, three of wands, okay, so you're choosing someone over someone else, okay, so you chose someone you want a victory with, okay, and this person that you choosing to have a victory with um, is a, is an emotional person, they're all in their emotions right now, or they will be. Or you're very emotional when it comes to this person you want to step off in a new beginning with. Holy Spirit, clarify this Queen of Cups. And this person is a Scorpio. Or they have it in their chart if they're not. Yeah. And you're waiting You're waiting patiently for this person, Cap, Capricorn. Okay. And this person is in hermit mode right now. They're in decision mode. Okay. Alright. Thinking of somebody that's in their past. Okay. All right. That they're in a building a relationship, working on a relationship with. Okay. And who who they offer the cup to, or they're thinking about. But yeah, who they offer the cup to, and they don't seem interested in the cup. The person they offer the cup to. Holy Spirit, clarify the four of cups. Okay, it's somebody that they're growing with. Okay, and they want to move forward with. Okay, so uh, I wish you luck with that. All right, all right. So, justice card. Okay, let me get the justice card. Okay, you want justice? You want a victory in a situation? Oh, my cards mixed up. Okay, cat, cat. You want um? Okay, 
Okay, you want a victory in a situation. Let's see, you want justice. Ho Holy Spirit, clarify this justice card. In Capricorn's reading, what September has for Capricorn. Okay. Okay, yeah. So you want justice in your marriage. Okay, the hair font card. Okay, or in your relationship. Holy Spirit, clarify the hair font card. Okay, clarify this hair font card. Clarify this hair font card. Okay, yeah, you want to move forward in your marriage. You want justice. You want a victory. You want to be able to move forward with the marriage. Holy Spirit, clarify the eight of wands. Okay, yeah, you're happy and content with your marriage. Okay, you want to move on to better waters within your marriage. Holy Spirit, clarify. Okay, yeah, you're feeling like you're out in the cold right now. Okay? Yeah. But you choosing. You choose a new beginning with the person that you're married with. Okay, and this is a, a Aquarius. Okay? Who you want to build your heal your relationship with okay all right okay the two of pentacles okay juggling Okay, somebody's juggling. Let's find out who it is, Cap. You or somebody in your energy, Holy Spirit. Or you're juggling. It could be finances you're juggling. Holy Spirit, clarify this two of pentacles. Clarify this two of pentacles, Holy Spirit. Okay, yeah, you're juggling a family situation. Holy Spirit, clarify this ten of pentacles. Ten of Pentacles. Clarify this Ten of Pentacles, Holy Spirit. Okay, yeah. Okay, with yeah, you're in a third party. You're juggling a family. Somebody that has a family. Okay, you have them in a third party um situation. This is a um somebody that's happy and content with their um family. Okay, um, this is this card is a cancer card, so it could be a cancer. Okay, yeah, you want a victory with this cancer with this person that's happy and content with their family. You want a victory with them. Okay, Capricorn, Holy Spirit, clarify this Ace of Wands. Holy Spirit, clarify this Ace of Wands. Clarify this Ace of Wands. Okay, yeah. Okay, yeah, you want a victory. Oh, okay. They have either Aries in their chart. A King of Wands. Aries, Cancer. Okay, this person. Okay, King of Wands person. Okay, you want a victory with them. Capricorn. And they have cancer in their chart. Okay. Holy Spirit, clarify the King of Wands. Okay, I'm going to do one more card. This person innerly satisfies you. Holy Spirit, clarify. Clarify this King of Wands. Holy Spirit. What? Well, it's making me take it. Yeah, you want stability with this person. The... Nine of Pentacles. Okay. All right. I wish you luck with that. Third parties are never good. But hey. Okay. Um. The Empress. Okay. So somebody may be pregnant, Capricorn. Or this is you. Are you pregnant? Okay. Okay. 
Okay, Holy Spirit clarify this Empress card. Are you going to find out somebody's pregnant in the month of September? Or are you going to find out you're pregnant? Holy Spirit, clarify the Empress card. Holy Spirit, clarify the Empress card. Holy Spirit. Okay. Okay, yeah. Somebody's deceiving you about a pregnancy. About a, them having a family. Or them about them being pregnant, Capricorn. Okay, or you're deceiving somebody about that. That you're pregnant. Okay, this is a secret. That you're hiding from someone. That you're being deceiving about a pregnancy. Or somebody is doing this to you okay so let's clarify this moon card holy spirit clarify this moon card clarify holy spirit okay yeah the eight of wands okay so it's a secret and it's gonna it's gonna quickly be found out that you've been deceiving Okay, you've been deceiving a Gemini. Okay, you've been you've been deceiving a Gemini about a pregnancy, or they've been deceiving you, Capricorn, about a pregnancy. Or they're gonna come in and let you know that you've been deceived. This card is somebody coming in, so this Gemini is gonna come in. Oh wait a minute, hold up with libra okay a king of swords yeah they're gonna come in a gemini with libra in their chart they're gonna come in and notify you that someone has been deceiving you about a pregnancy so maybe it's been a, being hidden from you okay so maybe this is being hidden but they're gonna come in and let you know about this Pregnancy. Holy Spirit, clarify this, King of Swords. Yeah, Page of Swords, okay? And they cut this person off. They, they, the person, they cut the person off, okay? See? The Page of Swords, that means you cut the person out. They block this person, this um, being, this being deceiving you. Holy Spirit, clarify. Or the person that's been deceiving you has blocked you. Okay. Okay, and this person is an Aquarius. That they blocked. Queen of Swords. <clears throat> or they've been blocked by a Queen of Swords by Aquarius. Aquarius blocked them as well. Okay, um, Holy Spirit, clarify this Queen of Swords. Clarify this Queen of Swords. Yeah. Okay, yeah, this Queen of Swords has them feeling like they're out in the cold. Okay, this Aquarius person has the person that's being deceived and feeling like they're out in the cold. Alright. Five of Pentacles. Alright, this I'm going to leave it right there. I wish you luck with that situation. That's going to be juicy in September. But don't do anything crazy when you find out. If the person comes to you, if this does take place in, in September, act mature, sensible about the situation. I know that's going to be hard to do. You know, but hey, you're going to come out on top. You know, you were the one to see you. So you're going to come out on top. They're going to have a lot of loss in this. Okay. The deceiver is. Okay. All right, so, you know, God bless, okay, and be strong, hold your head up, you guys, I hope you enjoyed the reading, again, like my video, share my channel, okay, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe to my channel, okay, stay tuned, okay, for more to come, God bless you guys, good night, love, peace, and happiness to you all.